Alrighty. Welcome back to another episode of Casual Play, Casual Help, episode 23. We are officially out of the bees and not and out of the seas. It doesn't doesn't seem like like it's like it's been been that long. But but but, but then again, there are. Yeah, how, how many do we have? Oh no no no! Stop it! Stop it! There there we go. Let's see how many do we have have, have in the bees? Because we did because we had a lot of A's. One, two, three. Wow, only six B's. How many C's? Yeah, I can, got a few C's. But anyway, on to, on to the first C. Kabraken, the destroyer of mountains. He's a guardian. So that means we've got, we've got to bulk up defense and HP. Or whatever. On to skins. As always, standard and palette swap, which is called Rampage. Cobra! Gamma Slam, which is a re which is a reference to Hulk, is a bit yeah. It's a palette swap, but, but but with additional stuff like his out outfit and his skin skin color and hair. Watch out. One of the funniest skins, Fat Loki. <laughs> it's kind of self-explanatory because it's just Fat Loki. Trimmer tech in, on a part of the other tech. Uh, themed one. I mean, this one's uh, this one's pretty cool because one of his special things that he can do is ride his ride his she ride one of his shields like a surf surfboard. Nerd rage. If 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 you're into the stereotypical nerd attire like the glasses, suspenders, and whatnot, but also him just being absolutely ripped. This one's for you. Back from the dead. Pharaoh's Curse, if, if you if you like uh, Egyptian stuff, th this one's this one's for you. you will meet the Grave Maker, uh, <laughs> which is <laughs> really cool because his his face is a tombstone. If if you like cemeteries and uh, and stuff, this one's for you. Congratulations, you know how to pick a winner. Then the Crusher is a skin that you could get from like a Twitch Prime subscription combined with Smite and whatnot. And it's limited skin, but I really don't care or and or mind. Now on onto abilities. Seismic Crush, which is a which is a, a stem slash buff to Cabracken where it increases his movement speed and he get Increases movement speed, attack speed, and also you gain haste, which means that you're not slowed down by basic attacks that miss. Refraction Shield has is a is one of the few abilities in this this game that has a passive and an active. The passive is, is that when you take damage, it stores stores up energy and gain protections from it, and when you activate it, uh, the shield gets slammed together, and if you're at max stacks. The person that you hit is stunned. And for the third, third ability, Tremors is uh, causes uh, er, like a mini earthquake in, a, in an AOE around him, which jostles uh, people around. It, and it, uh, and it's, it's supposed to drag them towards uh, Cabra towards Cabracken, but it's really easy to to get to get out of it. And then his ultimate tectonic shift, he, you st stomp on the ground, and out in front of you, it. Uh, Springs up walls, which could be instantly taken out by your basic attacks, but takes three hits to destroy. And it's mainly d uh, just to trap trap people in th that are uh, trying to run away. And for his passive, uh, you you and nearby allies take uh, five percent reduced damage within a range of thirty. But enough enough talking about Cabracken. Let's see what he can do. <sighs> now, now Cabracken is one of the uh, more aggressive and slash initiating types of guardians, because because the real strategy is to go in with size with seismic crush, uh, find uh, find somebody, stun them. Uh, if you have if you have your max stacks on on your two, uh, stun them again with your shield, and then pop tremors. To, to disorient them, 
And like with most guardians, it's a really good idea to go uh, to go uh, stone of binding for first item to for the uh, for the uh, decreased protections for CC and whatnot. And like last episode, pop XP because I just don't don't want it anymore. <laughs> We got a pretty good team. A lot of guys that can capitalize off off the stands. Man, it's been like two months since, since my Alpwash video. We were doing so so poorly in that episode. Oh boy, a Sasano. And seeing a Sasano in this game means only one thing. Cancer. But it looks like he may not be as cancerous as other Sasanos that are diamond and have stars around it. But we can only hope. And that guy has has my favorite Agni skin. Do you, do you like me some some World War One and World War Two? Korea, I don't know. Vietnam, why? As always, Sentinel's gift for the for the additional gold and whatnot. And he's done the binding. Things to look out for on the enemy team for their guardian Sobek is his it's his dash, which if it hits uh, an enemy god, it stuns him and throws him back. Sasano, because it's Sasano. Agni, uh, because of his stun, stun potential. Ah. Uh, Gilgamesh is slow and in his drop kick, which is be able to dis disorient people, and Medusa for her high damage output, and also her her ultimate. That's right, you better run, run, boy. Bad. Sometimes bad things just happen. All right, he's more, he's more physical. Minion no, lion first. Ooh, got him good. Be right back. You see on how I took all that and still didn't die? This, that, this is this is why playing Guardians can be amazing. And then then there's like the other times where we just get completely melted by you don't know what. Because of course everything in Smite uh, is a skill shot. Ultimate is down. 
Ultimate is ready. What did I say? I prob probably could have done something more, but I don't don't think so. Enough, we're so close that we can just wait. Nice job, guys. Thanks. Ultimate is ready. Pretty good push. Thanks. Do, 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 do. Time to be right back. Yeah, big thing. Big thing to be be mindful of it is as an as an instigator, you really gotta be be prepared to just get absolutely dived on. As you saw with like literally everyone on the enemy team going after me when I got plucked by Sobek. Mindful, if, if you use your ultimate, try to make sure that that the person doesn't ha have a leap that that's up, because they can just jump right right over your wall. Oh, is that a kitty cat I hear? Hi, Indy. Hey, baby girl. What you what you doing? I hope you're being good. Don't want you to be messing with my cords again. Uh -oh. oh, that is so unfortunate. Uh, 
as well, might as well back and get more items. One of the one of the uh, funniest things that you can do with Karakin is go full damage with him. Just, just literally just melt people within six within seconds. She purified that. HP back and our item. And as always, our new hunter's garb. on the other side. That sucks. Come here, Indy. Don't get under there. Come here. Purification. Oh, and he even has ages too. That is so. He is so scared. No more friends can die. Time to make things right. So pathetic. Uh -oh. That Gilgamesh coming in hot. And running away. Good job. Ultimate is ready. Cult claps all around. Ultimate is down. Indy, stop that. What? Oh, he built Mantle of Discord! <laughs> Another coward move. Especially by an, by an assassin. Time's a rumble. 
And also the reason why I'm upgrading this specific blessing is because I get more gold and a percentage of my health back for mi for minions. On my way. Ultimate is down. I can hear you purring under there, Andy. I know where you're at. <laughs> Stop running from me. Stop it. Ultimate is ready. Anyway, that gives us, gives us enough, enough money. That... Indy, no, no. No, no, come here. Come here. Here you go. Nice! Stopped him before they could do more harm. An ally has been slain. Going back where the cords are. An but it's not where a cat slain. needs to be. <laughs> Thanks. They both kept staring at my gauntlet. As always, hope you learned something from this, and I'll see y'all in the next episode. Bye.